Five best ways that you can do to maintain your hard earned weight loss without dieting and exercise. Now, the first one that we're gonna talk about is about how to, to reduce stress, um, to suppress your appetite, okay? Now, when you're stressed, your body increases cortical steroids, or in, in other words, co uh, cortisol, which is your stress hormones. When your stress hormones increases, your body goes into a fight or flight response. When your body's in a fight or flight response, it automatically drives you to have an increase in appetite, which then helps you or helps your brain to really go out there and crave for foods that makes you feel good, right? So that's what um, we call emotional eating. So this is probably one of the worst things you can do to, um, to basically trying to maintain your, your weight loss when you're stressed. Because literally, this is where most people fail at because they are automatically uh, eating uh, and oftentimes when they're eating, they're oftentimes eating to feel good rather than to eating for a nu nutritional value. The second thing is trying to, to reduce your sugary uh, drinks. Now sugary drinks, most people would think would be like pop, right? But most people also don't understand how much sugar, uh, uh, sugars or carbs are in your regular juice drinks, okay? So you also want to reduce those because again, increasing carbs will automatically increase in your body's ability to store um, calories as fat. Consuming more proteins. Proteins are very important, as we know, for muscle building, okay? But at the same time, when you consume uh, proteins, it actually help you to become more full, and which will help to decrease your appetite, um, and which will limit the amount of snacking that you would normally do, uh, especially when you are stressed. Consuming more fibers. Fibers, as we know, is very uh, productive for our digestion. Uh, it also kind of slows down the digestion a little bit, so it helps your body to kind of catch up uh, rather than just eating and burning and then having a lot of, uh, of blood sugar um, increase, which would then leads into directly into a fat uh, storage mode. So fiber actually kind of slows everything down, helps us to absorb things uh, much um, slower, which would then help you to limit a lot of the fat storage. Uh, at the same time, fibers are actually very, very good in the intestine as a whole, which also increase your immune system. When you have a better immune system, you're gonna be less stressed. The last one is actually one of the more important ones that people really don't realize, is just consuming more healthy snacks. Uh, most people don't realize that about 30% of the calories that we that we consume during the course of a, of a day comes from snacking. Okay, so you can limit your snack or limit um, the snack of poor unhealthy foods and trying to consume more healthy snacks such as proteins and fibers which are inclusive of vegetables. You can limit those um, snacking unhealthily and, and, and increase your healthy snack. You're gonna cut down a lot of calories um, during the course of the day. So these are the five very important things to really help you guys maintain your weight loss that you have worked so hard uh, at with your very strict regimen of dieting and also exercising. So please um, like our channel if you guys like the topics that we have um, talked about and uh, please let us know if you guys want us to cover anything else. Thank you.